Okay, guys, so I just unboxed the Panda Portable um, Dryer. So I'm about to sit here and put this together, and I will come back to you once it's all finished. And 10 minutes later, this is what we're looking like. So this is the legs that it stands on, and this is the little heater thing right here, and it has a cord. The cord is not very long. I'm going to be putting this probably in my bathroom because it's pretty large. You see my dryer, I mean my washer back there. It says Panda, has a zipper um let's go around here this is how we're looking and i'm gonna just show you the inside real quick i'm gonna zip this down here. so this is just the inside with no clothes and that's the actual thing you put the hangers on i'm assuming i'm hoping i didn't do nothing wrong right here that's probably just a vent to like let the air out or something but yeah and that's the actual dryer part down there let me zip this down a little more that's how the dryer looks and that's the little thing so water don't get on the dryer and yeah that's pretty much it so come back to you guys when i put my clothes All in right, here so i just took these clothes out of the um portable washer the magic chef one if you guys see my last video if you didn't definitely go look at that so i'm just hanging up the clothes that i washed they're pretty much not dry but they're definitely damp so as you can see it has a lot of different spots where you can hang these hangers um this fits three hangers on each of these little things right here. So I'm going to definitely fill this up. And down here is the actual heater part. And it has this little thing to catch the water. I have a pair of jeans. Somebody also said that if you use the little velvet hangers, it leaves wet, st wet spots on your clothes. So we're going to try that out. I use these little plastic hangers that I had. only had a little bit. This is the full look of it. My bathroom is pretty small. So yeah, that's how it's looking. I put it in the bathroom just because of the moisture. I didn't want it to like mess up my room. I don't know. But yeah, I'm going to show you and I'm going to upset it. And then we're going to come back in like an hour and see how dry all the clothes so, are. As you guys can see, I really packed this thing up. I got shirts, I got underwear, I got sweatpants right here. I got a pair of jeans in here. You can't see them, but they're back there. I got a whole like bunch of stuff in here this almost is my full load of laundry that i did today so i'm gonna set this and i'll be back i'm gonna set it for like an hour and see what it dried in an hour and we'll be right so it's on 60 minutes i don't know if it's focusing if you guys can see that all right i'm back so it's been basically an hour the machine is actually still on and i touched my clothes and they are still they're damp like they're like almost dry after an hour some things you know, like the sweatpants wouldn't be dry. Actually, they're somewhat semi. You just add another, I'm going to say, hour, and everything should be ready. I do have a lot of clothes in here. I'm not going to lie to you. But I'm going to add another hour, and then I'll come back, and they should be completely dry. And it is hot in the bathroom at the moment. It's like if you took a steamy shower. So I think this would be best in a shower. Like what's dry? For some reason, certain things are not dry yet. But... This is strange. My sweatpants in here are actually dry and it's been an hour and 30. So that's strange. I don't know if like it depends on the placement of like where you put stuff at. But yeah, so I'm going to take some of this stuff out after an hour and 30 minutes. I'm going to come back and show you what's not dry. Two hours and I would say, yeah, about two hours. This is all the clothes that the dryer dried. So that was really the load. I have like about five more pieces in there. I had added them late, but I have like a bunch of shirts, shorts. I even got some bras and things like that. I even got a pillowcase. I tried my jeans is like basically almost dry. So yeah. That's basically the review of the Panda Dry. I think next time I won't put as much stuff in there as I did. Because you see, it's a lot of stuff. I used probably like, it probably was like 16, 17 items in that dryer. So I would say off the back, just do two hours, two hours, 30 minutes if you have as much as me. But probably just don't put that much in there. But yeah, would I recommend it? Yes. But in the future, I probably will get a bigger one. More than likely because I do have a lot of clothes to wash. But yeah, other than that, thanks so much for watching my video.